Nordahl Stenson, Hari Singh, and Cicely Decker. Scuderia Pinarolo have emerged victorious as the winners of the 2024 Est Gravel Race, each one with two up sprints after the 200 kilometers of racing on the Sundrench Day of Racing in Iceland. The 200 kilometers route used a counterclockwise loop around Hegla, with the majority of the 2,165 meters of elevation gained in the opening 70 kilometers. When Stenson won the race last year, it was the first pro gravel victory of his career. He said this year, with 60 kilometers to go, he could tell other riders in the front group were suffering from the intense pace, so he made a solo attack. It went perfect. I had a great day and raced hard all day and managed to grab the win in the end, Svensson said. Dracow was the last rider to fall back from the lead group with under 40 kilometers to go and lead the sprint to the Svensson Ferrer duo. I just stayed with the group and pushed on the climbs. We rotated super hard. I went solo, after 60 kilometers, and after a while Diago caught me. We were riding together the last 45k and we were both quite tired. We just wanted to go for the sprint, Svensson said. In the minutes pro slash elite, Diago Ferreira, Montañas Mahigas, was second end. In Parabarsen, Shrek Island, six minutes back in third. In the women's race, Decker was matched after the opening 30 kilometers by Carolina Migan. She was able to outkick Migan at the finish line. The duo had distanced all challengers after the opening 30 kilometers and opened an 11-minute margin across the middle of a race over to make sure we would take third place. Decker, in her first international gravel race, was quoted saying, I just tried to make it really hard from the start. Carolina and I got away at about 20 kilometers, and she was really strong. We were evenly matched for the whole day. I went into the race with an aggressive plan to make it hard and drive the pace early. The no draft rule gave me the freedom and confidence to attack and lead the others, knowing they would not be pulled back to me by the men. We also squashed a common misconception that the women's race will be significantly slower if we are unable to draft off of men. We smashed the course record by over 30 minutes in the first installment of this race with these new rules in place. In the women's pro slash elite, Carolina Migan, Paracing, was second end. She like Schroers, specialized, SD works. 11 minutes back in third. Nothing can prepare you for the spectacular nature that greets you in Iceland. To race through this landscape is a dream come true. The race course starts out of a small town along the southern coast called Wolfsloon. It is lined with countless natural wonders such as cascading waterfalls, black sand beaches, glaciers, and volcanoes. Every July since 2016, the idea was to bring people to the Icelandic highlands and show the best of Iceland's nature and landscape. This event has a reputation as one of the biggest and best gravel races in Europe. The participants of the Rift are privileged to have explored areas of this country far away from the tourist trail that very few will ever see. The Rift Gravel Race returns in 2025. Thanks, legends, and I hope you are all well. Don't miss a moment from the sports that you follow. Help us to bring you the best content possible. Subscribe, share, like, and vote in the community polls.